Now, this video will give you an explanation on how to just possibly upload plugins uh, using your WordPress backend system. Now, it can be a V2 website, it can be any kind of website you are running, but uh, your challenge is to upload a plugin. Now, if you use the Word uh, WordPress upload uh, system area, it may not actually give you ability to upload a file that is larger than uh, maybe 500 megabytes or something. So how do you go about it? One of the way of doing that is what I want to show you on this video. But if I continue, please do it to subscribe to the channel, which is Legica Business TV. Here we cover everything on financial freedom, B2 technology, crypto, forex, mobile app development, online business, ICTs like web development uh, tutorials and how to do uh, technical things as regards to web uh, site design and development so it's actually completely free of charge so do it to subscribe and turn on the bell notification icon so that when we make a video like this you will notify right away now actually this video is actually requested by somebody so uh, if you are watching the video or even if it's not requested by somebody and <laughs> you are searching uh, youtube or internet how to uh, install WordPress a uh, plugin from the backend. You can easily follow this tutorial to get started. Now, to get started, you need to log into your WordPress dashboard either through your uh, smartphone or through a laptop, whichever means is is okay. So once you are there, you just quickly go to to plugins and then click on Add New. Okay, so you just click on plugin. Look at it here. So click plugin, then you I click on Add New. So You'll be directed to a place like this. So what you need to do is to go to this search bar. You can see it here at the top here, where you see keyword. And then once you are here, what you need to do is to just click and then search for file manager, that keyword, file manager. So the system will automatically search it from the WordPress respiratory okay so that's what we'll call it uh, wordpress respiratory so we have could actually fetch it actually i have already installed it but i just want to show you you must download you must install the one that has one million active users so you can see it here right here it has about five star rating so you can see it is actually active but i just want to show you how to call it so once you have it you just have to click on install now just like citing an example just click install now allow the system to install the the plugin so once it installed then click activate so once you activate it then it takes you to the you click on the you scroll down at the extreme right here you have to see the call to action here which is wp file manager so you just have to click on it once you click on it to direct you to the to the what's it called the wp template manager so you can see it right away so what is this application do or the wordpress uh, plugin does is this it will actually uh, assume or assume your wordpress uh, interface as a c panel so and you can upload a file that is even uh, 20 megabytes or even more than that so on this place how do you make use of it all you have to do is to master the icons this kind this uh, icons that are here you need to master how to make use of it so i'm going to show you just in brief so for instance if you want to upload a wordpress uh, plugin from this section you must already have the wordpress uh, plugin downloaded from your pc or your phone all you have to do is to have your mouse and click upload file so the system will ask you for a file or folder so normally uh, wordpress plugin is always a folder so always select a folder so select it it will take you to the resource of your laptop or your phone and then ask you to upload so you just have to upload it and once you upload it you need to click on the plugin and then extract for instance this is uh, one of the plugin that is I'm just like using example so right click the, the plugin you have uploaded and then choose extracts okay extracts here okay extracts or file so you must click on the uploaded plugin normally it's not a folder please it's supposed to be a zip file so once you're uploading make sure it's a zip file so click, click on select file please it's keep my mind so you shouldn't make mistakes you shouldn't upload it wordpress is not always a, a folder it's actually a zip file so once you upload it you extract it once the extraction is done then you go to your plugin uh, area 
your plugin uh, section, which is all the um, installed. Once you go to the uh, installed plugin sections, then you now activate the plugin that you have uploaded. So remember, install, extract, then activate. So these are the three process you need to go through. So let me know in the comment section if you like the video like this, just come here and they activate it. If you like videos like this, uh, comment, uh, share, please do more videos on this so that I can know that people are interested in learning web site design and development so I can be able to make more videos teaching you some tricks and tips on WordPress development. So, and then uh, uh, those of you that are new to the channel, we cover several topics and ranging from telecom, crypto, forex, mobile app development. So, line business in general. So, make sure you stick around the channel, subscribe, and like, and share the video. Thanks and God bless.